Okay guys, so I just want to show you my uh, latest gun in my collection. This is a uh, Ruger uh, New Bearcat, is what they call it. Um, it, it it's, a, it's a 22, and I, you probably can't tell in the video, but it's, it's a pretty small gun. I'll, I'll compare it to my 357 uh, shortly, but... Um, this is really the only gun that I've been wanting to add uh, to my collection. I, I'm more into the old western type guns. Uh, the newer stuff don't really interest me. But this was really the, the last gun that uh, I've been wanting to add. I've been, I've been eyeing these up, or one of these up, since I got my 357. So, finally got one and it, it's an awesome little gun guys it's it's this this thing's going to be really fun to shoot uh just shoots a, a long rifle 22 so it's going to be uh it's going to be real cheap to shoot so i really don't know uh what to say about it guys it, it's a it's a really good gun um it, it's a ruger so i expect the quality to be there it uh, feels good. It, it's actually got a a lot stiffer uh, cock than um, I was expecting uh, for a 22. It, it takes a little bit of effort to actually pull that back. So um, yeah, wasn't expecting that from a from a 22. But okay, so on the cylinder here. They've got it all engraved. They got a bear on there. I'll get a better picture. This is probably not showing up very good. They got a bear on there and some sort of uh, some sort of cat. I'm not sure if that's a, a mountain lion or what, but then they got the Ruger bear cat, 22 uh, long rifle on there. So. Pretty neat guys. It's uh, like I said, it's going to be a fun gun to shoot. Uh, I guess I can... Sh I don't think you're supposed to shoot them uh, or pull the trigger like that with them. Uh, not loaded, but a few times I don't think it's going to hurt it. Uh, trigger feels good. Um, and you're going to... Pull that back and then you're going to load it right there. The light is usually good right here, but for some reason we're getting a... It'll hold six 22s. So it is a, it is a six shot. I thought it was a five shot, but it is a six shot. So I don't know if I mentioned it earlier, but uh, it's got a really nice wood grip on here. My uh, Ruger Vaquero uh, came with a, a plastic grip. And it's, it's actually right here. I actually uh, got some custom made wood grips for this thing. Which I think really set the gun off a lot better than the black plastic ones that come with it. but. This is my 357 guys, we'll do a little side-by-side -side comparison here. You can see the, the 357 is quite a bit bigger. This is a, a pretty little gun guys. Um, I got the, my Colt 22 right here. And it, it's, it's smaller than that gun even guys. Got a shorter barrel. But yeah, even the handle, everything's really small about it. But it should be a fun gun to shoot. 22 should be easy gun to shoot, even though it's kind of small. It does have a good bit of weight to it. But um, I can't wait to get this thing out, guys, and, and uh, do a little bit of shooting. So probably going to make a, a, a custom gun case like I have here uh, for this guy. 
it uh this wasn't really that hard just got some foam and i cut it out and made a real nice gun case uh it, the funny thing is that when you buy these guns they don't give you much of a case seems like you get a custom case especially for what they cost but um you don't so i'm gonna probably pick up a cheap case and make me a custom uh, gun case i definitely don't want this thing rolling around in a plastic case you know scuffing up the the gun especially with all the the carving that's done on this thing it, it's it's really neat but anyway guys i guess that's going to do it for this there ain't much to say about it it's um just a neat little gun that i've been wanting for a really long time finally finally picked one up I'll have some shooting video of this shortly. Um, I'm going to get out, uh, try to get out to the range once it uh, gets a little warmer and I get some time to get out there. But yeah, neat little gun, guys.